on the East Coast in Moncton, and this is where the cool place is to be. Uh, at one time, people said, why do I live here? Now, uh, a few months ago, we were actually the number one place in Canada to invest. So we were the best kept secret for so long. Uh, what happened to our real estate? Nothing. Uh, if you didn't know what was happening in the rest of Canada, you didn't even know that the prices were going up. Well, then that COVID thing happened, and then people realized, I don't want to live in big cities. Let's go to places like Moncton. So we're still a hot market here. Um, you know, it's it's different throughout the provinces. And if people say, oh, it's cooled off. It's cooled off some here, but not to the degree in other places. Um, right now, we have about a thousand properties on the active on the MLS system. I know some of you are saying, I probably got that in my backyard. Well, that's not a lot for us here. Uh, we've actually taken a little dip compared to October of last year, We're down about 30%. But again, last year in 2021 was the height of everything. Um, at uh, last year in October, we had 1.7% inventory. Oh, now we're up to 4%. Two, three, three things have happened with that. Number one is, of course, is the interest rates have increased. So the market flattened out a little bit in that not as many multiple offers. So we still have some properties. There's still properties going over asking price. Um, we're seeing now, most of them are going somewhere between 96, 97%. So if it was a hundred thousand, you know, you're buying it for 96, 97, before you were buying it for 110, 120. The average price here in Atlantic Canada, 300,000 gets you into a great home. Add another 100,000, you're an executive home which would probably be not even a one bedroom in Vancouver, Victoria, but hey, you know, that's just how it goes playing out. So things are things are still happening here is in a good sense. Um, the NSA, interest rates only because people are just kind of leveling off a little bit. We have a lot of people working from home, which has been a challenge for us because everybody was buying outside the cities. And I don't know if you heard today's announcement, but we need internet. So the federal government's bringing us 27,000 more internet connections because it's okay to live 30 minutes outside of Moncton. It's okay to live 45 minutes. Internet's been challenging for that. So we're, we're coming up a lot with that. Uh, we're still seeing an average about 20 houses on the market a, uh, a day during the week here. And what's noticing the, the biggest is we're getting 10 to 12 each day where the prices are decreasing. Now that could be anywhere from 5,000 to 20,000 based on our price points. So it is going down a little, a little bit. Is there still deals? There's still deals for the flippers out there, just higher prices that you have to look at.